Thank you so much, Ashley. So if you're filling out your Christmas list this season, there are some great causes out there that have some really unique gift ideas. Mike Morrison of Mike's Bloggity Blog is here. He scoured the entire internet, which is huge. Every page. That takes a while, doesn't well, it? I have no friends. Gifts with a cause. Mike, thanks for coming Hi, in this thanks morning. thanks for having me. Merry Christmas, guys. It's good to How's be here. going? It's so good. Yeah. And you're here twice. The second twice. time later on today, we're going to talk about some Christmas sites. But first, these are the ones that get them into the Christmas spirit. And yeah. the right up there is the Calgary Zoo. Yeah, Calgary Zoo is the first one. So the idea behind this is that, like, I'm a material, I'm kind of a materialistic person. I always like gifts. But if you've been reading the headlines lately, all the charities are suffering so much yeah. this year. So this year, uh, all my friends are getting charitable gifts. They are. So good this is come with some of them that we're going to be talking about. So Calgary Zoo, something local. Um, the elephant there, uh, Kamala, mm -hmm. she yeah. paints things with her trunk, right? So we all know that they actually sell these paintings. So you can buy the originals or you can buy prints or you can buy posters and all the money goes back to the Calgary Zoo. So that's kind of giving them something like tangible and a nice thing they can put in their house. It's a very and then neat you're helping idea. at the Calgary Zoo. Uh, Kids Up Front's the next one. This is my favorite, favorite Calgary charity. I love it so much. Basically, they take your ticket donations to any events, hockey games, theater, concerts, things like that, and then they give them to kids who wouldn't normally have the chance. So a great Christmas gift idea would be to give up your New Year's Eve Calgary Flames tickets yeah. to anyone who wants to do that Wouldn't challenge. That be huge? Uh, and give them to chair give them to kids up front. Then a kid who would never normally get to see a game of that caliber gets to experience it. And then you can say like, oh Dave, I gave my tickets to this person. Isn't that great? Thrill of a lifetime yeah, for these kids. Crazy. It's and really it's good. anything. Movie tickets, whatever. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Kids up front. Uh, this is Can Canada Helps. Canada Helps. So I did scour every single page of the internet but there's so many there's 83,000 charities in Canada alone wow. like uh, uh, in Canada so this charity basically is like a database of all the Canadian charities and you can donate $20 as a gift card to Canada helps and then uh, I give it to you and then you go to Canada helps website and you pick out of the 83,000 websites oh, what okay. where you want your 20 you find bucks to what go connects to. with you and exactly ah, yeah it just kinda, it's like a charity database I guess mm -hmm. yeah it's very cool canadahelps.org yes uh, next Oxfam. Oxfam Unwrapped this is kind of the f big one that a lot of people know um, you can give everything from uh, water bottles uh, seeds goats uh, spoiler alert my niece and nephew Zachary and Brianna you guys are getting a goat for Christmas <laughs> and not an actual goat my mom was like what am I gonna do with mosquito net and I was like, you don't get the mosquito net mom. <laughs> anyway. yeah, but I love this one I've done this one in years past yeah, yeah. it's great and mm -hmm. it's it's cheap it starts at twelve dollars yeah. like twelve dollars that's a movie pass to and go it to means the, the world of someone somewhere exactly else, right? yeah 50 trees uh, is $35 Wow. 50 trees. 50 and trees a box set of DVDs is like 49. Mm -hmm. Like, what has more value? Yep. 50 trees. Ending poverty. What about that? Uh, UN. So this is a really good one. This is a one based in Calgary, actually. And uh, you go to the website, there's a really cool video of like Boxing Day and how obsessed we are with sales. But basically, uh, this, uh, you can contribute money, $20, and then it'll go to ending poverty of different organizations you can choose from. Uh, lots of different, um, lots of different poverty organizations all over the world. So this one's international, so not just in Canada. Uh, Benin Orphanage is the next one. This is actually kind of near and dear to my heart. This is a family in New Brunswick. This isn't a big organization or anything like that. This is a family in New Brunswick. I guess that one of the sons uh, traveled to West Africa, f discovered this orphanage, just kind of made it his passion to make sure that they uh, have money and things like that. It's run by seven volunteers who has, haven't accepted a dollar for their own work since two, uh, 1993. Oh. Yeah, and so basically it's, it's kind of more uh, casual in the sense that you just send this family in New Brunswick money and then they'll send you back a card but the money goes directly to the orphanage. Really so. grassroots, which is nice. Exactly, yeah. and it's like 50 children there that have all been abandoned or orphaned or things like that. Oh. So yeah, yeah, definitely grassroots for sure. Great mm -hmm. story. Okay, uh, this next one. Skatestein? Yeah, I think that's, how, yeah, so basically it's a, a skateboarding school in Afghanistan. Uh, Skatestan, I should say. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and so it's this really great uh, organization that teaches kids, takes kids off the streets, take kids who are in trouble in Afghanistan, and teaches them skills that come with skateboarding. So it's not just skateboarding, but it's all the cooperative education, things like that, that go with it. But basically, it gets them wow. off the street, gets them in a mentorship program, and you can buy like a t-shirt for $35. 
So that's a great gift that you can give someone. Mm -hmm. It's 35 bucks, and that $35 is going to an amazing organization in Afghanistan. That's a really yeah. unique idea. Yeah, very yeah. unique. And there's really good pictures. And it's uh, what's great about it in Afghanistan is that it's open for all the girls there, too, which is sometimes an uh. issue there. So it's great. It's just, if you go on the website, they have all these great pictures of all these girls skateboarding. Oh, like good. That. So it's really great. I went ahead to the next slide by accident. Oh, right hello, there. Charity Water. Yes. Uh, Charity Water, a lot of great gift ideas. Basically, this. Uh, this goes to helping people uh, get uh, rain catchers and uh, filtered water and things like that. But you can buy bracelets, you can buy t-shirts, things like that, um, so that you're giving, again, giving someone a gift and then uh, the money's going elsewhere. So mm -hmm. it's two for one. Really. That's great. I like it. Yeah, the, the, all of these, you just feel good about it, right? You do, right? Yeah. 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 Let's light up the world. Light up the world Let's is so good. I like this one. <laughs> uh, so basically, obviously, we take for granted our lights, uh, especially in the studio. There's so many alone. <laughs> Yeah. So hot in here. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, but I like your sweater. You yeah, look thank you. Sweater. I don't know uh, if you're hot. It's a nice sweater. Uh, yeah. So this is a gift of light. Again, you're giving gift, uh, a gift of light to help an organization uh, in Southern America. It's fifty dollars for the gift of light. Uh, gift of gift of training to sh uh, train electricians to install the lights in houses and things like that is a hundred bucks. Mm. Hundred bucks. That's nice. That's. A nice sweater. <laughs> that's, I mean, <laughs> yeah. that's a couple nice sweaters probably. Yeah, exactly. The last one is Kiva. Kiva. This is really cool. I actually just found this one this week. Um, they basically, it's kind of like the, an entrepreneur uh, database. So all, a bunch of entrepreneurs all over the world. Uh, you can go on and get, get a gift card. Um, I give a gift card to Jill and then she goes onto this website and says, looks, looks through all the resumes and all the organizations and all the companies that these entrepreneurs have started and she can donate their money to them and they're all grassroots organizations and things like that. In so, different countries? All so. over the world. Really? Yeah, all over the world. So a lot of it, a lot of these gifts are, are giving the gift receiver the choice of choosing what they want, ah. which is kind of cool. Yeah. And so it also really like. gives them the opportunity to connect and get their head around the charity mm -hmm. and it makes it, it has more personal. Yeah, impact. like I'm excited when I give my nephew and niece their goat, like that's going to open it up in a, dis a discussion, right? We're going to be able mm -hmm. to talk about it. We're going to take out the globe and show them where the goat is going and ah. things like that. So it's, it's opening a really important discussion as opposed to like, here's a video game. Oh, Don't talk stuff. to me while you play it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Good work, Mike. Thanks, guys. That was inspiring. All right, breakfasttelevision.ca is where we'll have links to all of those websites that Mike mentioned. And you're staying with us. We're I not am. going anywhere. We're not going anywhere. It's too hot to go. Yeah. <laughs> we'll be right back on BT. Susan, we have entertainment to talk about. We're going to do entertainment headlines next on BT.